Let's talk about lithium. Lithium is a classic mood stabilizer used for mood disorder, especially for bipolar mood disorder. It alters the sodium transports in the neuron and modulates neurotransmitters like serotonin and dopamine. It has a narrow therapeutic index. That means a medication where the difference between the therapeutic dose and the toxic dose is small. This means even a slight changes in the dosage can increase the therapeutic failures and drug reactions. The therapeutic level is between 0.6 to 1.2 milli equivalent per liter. Toxicity occurs when blood concentration of lithium exceeds greater than 1.5 milli equivalent per liter. So patient who is taking lithium check blood concentration of drug frequently, preferably 12 hours once in starting stage and later on monthly ones. Adverse effects of lithium. Here is a mnemonic to remember adverse effects. The mnemonic is lithium. Here L I stands for leukocytes increase and T stands for tremors and H stands for hypothyroidism. I U stands for increased urination. Lithium may cause drug induced nephrogenic diabetes inhibitors. So patients will complain about increased urination. And M stands for malformation like Epstein anomaly in fetus. So during pregnancy lithium should be avoided. And the last and important thing is educate the patient to drink plenty of water because dehydration can lead to lithium toxicity. Lithium primarily exits via urine. If a patient is dehydrated means there will be a reduced amount of urine output and this can increase the blood level of lithium. And also educate the patient to take enough amount of salt because lithium reabsorption in the kidney is influenced by sodium levels. When sodium levels are low, the kidney reabsorb more lithium. Potential leads to increased lithium levels in the blood and cause toxicity. Maintaining a consistent sodium intake helps stabilize lithium level in the body. Consistency is key for patients who is on lithium and aspirants who are preparing for competitive examinations. Study consistently and make progress.